Hello my lovely SSMians. How are you guys doing? I hope you are fine and rocking as always. Today we are going to see how the month of July 2023 is going to be for you. If your birthday happens to be in the month of July 2023, I will be doing a special reading for you. Do check the timestamp below. So let's get started with today's option. Option number one is this beautiful amethyst ball. Option number two is this lovely yellow candle. And option number three is this sage bundle. So you can choose any option that you're drawn to in case if you're confused as to what option you should choose. You can also take three pieces of paper, write number one, two, three in each piece of paper and just say, dear God, Goddess, Archangels, how the month of July 2023 is going to be for me. And then just pick up any one piece of paper with your eyes closed. Whatever number comes, that's going to be your pile. Isn't that amazing? So let's get started. Hello group number one. So let's see how the month of July 2023 is going to be for you. So you have selected this beautiful amethyst ball, which means that uh, the month of July 2023 is going to be full of changes. You are going to get a lot of ideas, downloads, which you need to use in order to go ahead. I also see the color pink a lot. So maybe heart chakra love, the color of heart chakra is green, but I'm seeing pink a lot. So self love love is something which is going to be of focus now let's see what your cards are going to tell us let's see first your tarot cards with regards to how the month is going to be some card just fell on its own just to give it a moment i i feel that you've gone through some sort of uh, emotional a uh, heartbreak or some you know emotional loss and you have been trying your best to kind of overcome it maybe some uh, close friendship or relationship has kind of given you a you know it has been a little disappointing for you over there is what i am feeling now let me just see your cards okay beginning of the month mid of the month i'm also hearing the word fragrance so uh, maybe you will uh, buy some perfume get some perfume as a gift okay let me keep your cards aside let's see it one by one the beginning of the month the beginning of the month you have got the three of wands which means you are going to travel a lot as well I also feel that you're going to be busy with long term planning. You are going to take matters in your own hand. You're going to focus on what can be done in order to resolve certain things. I also feel that um, whatever you have been waiting for, you'll get clarity on that in the beginning of the month. Uh, you're going to work a lot with the fire element. Uh, it could be that you are uh, doing some prayers, rituals with fire as well. But yes, lot of long term planning, lot of, you know, ideas coming your way. The mid of the month, you have got Ace of Pentacles. So new beginnings with regards to your career and finances. You are uh, also going to plan your finances in the mid of the month. Also, there could be a possibility of someone giving you a um, cash gift or a gift in kind in the middle of the month. Okay, new beginnings. You're also going to focus on uh, an you know, environment in the middle of the month. The end of the month, you've got eight of cups. So do not be surprised if you go for, for a spiritual visit to a place which is full of higher vibration. With this card I, all, card, I also feel that you are going to walk away from something which is not serving you towards something which is going to fulfill you. Th that particular movement is not going to be like, you know, a willing movement, but a required movement. So 
when I'm seeing these three cards, the story that I can clearly get is in the beginning of the month, you are going to sit and plan how uh, your strategy and everything for the future. And while you're planning, an idea will struck you, a new project will start struck you and you will start working on that new project in the mid of the month. However, this new project will require you to kind of let go of certain commitments or certain things which are no longer serving you. So you will let go of that and move towards making this goal a full possibility. All right. That's what story I'm getting from these three cards. I will be teaching tarot in my upcoming tarot workshop and uh, I, there is a special early bird offer for this workshop to know more details about this workshop click on the link given in the pinned comment so many of you have been waiting for this workshop and I'm so glad to announce it now let's see your oracle cards okay let's see the changes coming your way the changes coming your way is decision. So with the three of wands, again, I'm not surprised. You are going to take a lot of important decisions and uh, those decisions are going to kind of help you to move ahead. Okay, a lot of important decision making happening. It's worth waiting for so with regards to a lot of things in your life okay like as i said okay over here in the beginning of the month uh, now three of wands even though it means long-term planning now long-term planning always means that there is a weight involved all right because you're planning right now about what should happen in future with regards to your goals and dreams so even there if there is a weight it will be worth waiting for and you'll be like you know what I did have to wait for this, but I'm so happy that it was completely worth uh, the entire, you know, uh, uh, frustration that was involved in this wait. Let's see how you need to nurture yourself. Alone time. Spending alone time is so important. It helps you to give, uh, you know, yourself some energetic boost. It also helps you to kind of you know get away from all the chaos and all the commitments and all the responsibilities recently one fine sunday half a day i was completely alone in my room and it was so important for me to get in touch with my core essence all right so yes this uh, month nurture yourself by spending some time alone that's your next card star family you're part of a team of souls call and support. So we many times feel that whatever we are doing on earth is only my work, my life purpose, but that's not so. The divine has chosen you to take physical action on the earthly realm. However, the divine has also provided you with an entire team who do all the work behind the scenes to ensure that your physical action happens smoothly. However, we need to be in touch with them we need to call them and uh, for example if you are doing some work with regards to a, your corporate and you are stuck there is no need for you to do that entire work alone you can just say dear god goddess archangels please i need help with this and the divine will send you your entire team to help you out okay so your star family is going to give that support that you need let's see the blessings coming your way yin yang yang so it means that there is going to be a balance in receiving and giving in the month of june uh, july 2023 i think that you had decided something in the month of june, june which will come to fruition in july as well also with this card i feel uh, there will be a, a balance in masculine and feminine energies have faith your dreams are coming to fruition i also feel that a masculine and feminine energy synergy will lead to something new okay now let's see what um, box is applicable to you okay so let me just okay we got this box let's open it So you have got the purple box. Now let's open the purple box and see what you have. All right. Mm -hmm. Interesting. You have chosen this purple crystal and you got the purple box as well. 
which clearly means that you have a connect with Archangel Michael. Now let's see this one at one by one. Oops, the dolphin just flew. So you have got this dolphin which has a small dolphin in its tummy, which means new beginnings, new projects, which is also showcased by the Ace of Pentacles. Isn't it amazing when the charms and the cards are in sync? So definitely a new beginning in the mid of the month. Okay, it could be a new project. It could be a, a, a new beginning in terms of a child as well. Let's see. You have got over here a beautiful, lovely emoji. So a lot of love. You will see the world with a lot of love and compassion. You have got super mom over here who is multitasking. So this could mean you. Okay, even if you are a man watching this video, we do we do you know uh, play so many roles okay even if you're a father at times you play the role of a mother as well and even if you're a mother at times you play the role of a father as well so definitely you are a super mom super dad so give yourself that credit for handling things so well okay if you're not a super mom don't or a super dad or if you're not a parent do not think oh my god but i'm not a parent this basically means that you are multitasking really really well you got over your life is a beautiful ride, which means enjoy this ride, all right? You have been taking everything so seriously. You need some time alone, as this card rightly said, okay? Let's see. You have got over here a person receiving gift, if you can see. Now, this clearly uh, is in sync with the Ace of Pentacle card, so definitely some sort of gift coming your way some sort of opportunity coming your way do not miss this opportunity okay i was just trying to and there's an upward growth as well i was trying to see that can you see the cards properly or is it me let me just zoom in zoom out okay okay let me go ahead maybe i it's just me today okay you got over here the charm of milk now milk rep represents nourishment so it's high time you nourish yourself nourish your soul as well wow look at this you have got a winking cloud okay which means there is going to be some sort of um, synchronization by the divine. You may also find it raining when you are least expecting. So always carry your umbrella and everything. Let's see your angel number. Okay, it's not coming. So you have got the angel number 71 which means that you are on the right path keep on having faith uh, it also means that keep your thoughts positive because lately you have been feeling very negative about life in general you've also been kind of you know feeling very lonely that's what i'm getting so keep your thoughts positive and uh, you are on the right path manifest the life that you really wish to have now let's open all the other uh, charms. Let's see the words that you have got. You got over here spiders. So spiders create a beautiful web, right? So this is telling you that you need to understand the intricacy, in, you know, the, the, the en entire part of life, all right? And you also need to ensure that you create a safe space for yourself, all right? You got the biggest so there is something which is very huge that's going to happen and it's time that you prepare yourself for it okay you work yourself over it you got over your bikes okay so definitely a forward movement some of you may need to pay attention to your bike as well if you have a vehicle okay you have got an angel charm over here this is so beautiful so again this is in sync with the uh, with the card that you got regarding support right so you have the support and i feel that you have an you you have a huge angelic support with you now let's see the alphabets that you have got okay let's open one by one you have got n you have got j 
this could be your first name middle name last name or it could be uh, it could be you know uh, a name which requires your attention or a word that requires your attention okay you have got j n w you have got two n's over here all right you have got a over here you have got L over here, you have got T over here and these nails are making me impossible to you know what I'm going to remove the nails in some time just give me two minutes once I'm done with this okay so you have got the alphabets J N W N L E T E A L okay these are the alphabets now let's see uh, some messages from the other cards as well regarding your month of June, July. Again and again, June is coming. So I believe that you will start something in the month of June, uh, which for uh, the results or the action, physical action will be taken in the month of July for the same. Okay, got two cards. Let's also pick some of these. Okay, you got three. Oh, four. Let's see it one by one. You got prosperity, so a lot of wealth coming your way. And with the Ace of Pentacles, again, not surprised. Even if it is a small prosperity, enjoy joy and courage. Okay, can you see this? You have got fame, so recognition coming your way. All right. You have then got jewelry. So some of you may buy jewelry, give someone jewelry as well. Let's see your white card. You have got you deserve better. Okay, so you deserve good things in life. And let's see your other yellow cards. You have got health analysis. So you'll be paying attention to your health. Okay. And the last card that you got, goodbye. So the eight of cups as it is in the same energy. So goodbye to the old and hello to the new. Okay, so a lot of new energy this month is going to get created. A lot of old energy is going to go. So now let's see what your wheel of fortune is going to tell us. So think about a question and let me spin the wheel for you. You have got jackpot, my friends. Group one, that's awesome. Group 1, I hope you enjoyed this reading as much as I did. If you did, do hit the like button to subscribe to my channel. We have we have a Telegram channel as well. You can be a part of it in Insta. Uh, we are a family of 29.3K okay, people, 29,000 people. Uh, my Insta account is verified. So uh, go to that, follow that particular um platform itself and yes we have a new tarot workshop coming up and there is an early bird offer do not miss it and let's 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 have an amazing july 2023 take care bye bye hello group two how are you guys doing i hope you're fine and amazing as always let's see how the month of july 2023 is going to be for you so you have chosen this lovely yellow candle, which means a lot of illumination ideas coming your way. With this candle, I also feel that there will be instances of joy uh, which you will experience. At times, joy is a pers the feeling of joy is a perspective more than anything else. So now let's see what your tarot cards are going to tell us. Let's see with regards to the beginning of the month, mid of the month and the end of the month. All right. I feel some of you are going to get some uh, beauty treatment done, is what I am hearing. I also heard the word salt, beginning of the month, mid of the month. And end of the month okay let's see 
the beginning of the month you got five of pentacles so you may feel insecure about something which is happening in your life so the circumstances may not be something which may make you feel insecure but you may feel insecure about because of your past experiences as well you are going to help people in the beginning of the month especially the the ones who are underprivileged i also feel that rather than focusing on worry focus on the actions that you can take to address that worry all right let's see your next card the mid of the month the mid of the month you have got eight of cups so you in the in the in uh, between of the month you will find yourself walking away from things which are not serving you you will also take steps to follow your soul's path you may also find yourself kind of isolating yourself from people around you to recharge yourself okay some of you may even visit a spiritual place or do spiritual activities the end of the month you have got three of wands which means you are going to make lot of plans i think you guys were confused between group 1 and group 2 because group 1 had similar cards so at the end of the month you will find yourself assimilating the entire month's experience and then uh, putting it into the boxes which you need to put in order to go ahead i also feel at the end of the month you are going to plan your future how the what are what, what your next steps are going to be whom you need to work with whom you need to kind of you know stay away from so a lot of planning happening at the end of the week a month so when i look at your three cards the story that i'm getting is in the beginning of the month because of the five of pentacles you may feel insecurity you may feel very uh, lost kind of a feeling that you know i don't have anybody however you will gather your courage inner strength tap into your inner power and you will decide to walk away from this feeling and as you walk away from this feeling you will decide to use your inner power inner strength to create a better future all right so if you look at this card you know here she is sad then she is walking towards light and it looks like she is very close to the to to light right now okay so that's how your journey is going to be i teach tarot cards in my upcoming tarot workshop uh, in which i teach you how to you know kind of how i made a story the same way even i teach the same we are having an early bird offer so click on the link given in the pin comments so that you don't miss that offer now let's get back to your cards so i've already removed your tarot and angel cards i will just read them for you okay so this are your cards let's see the changes coming your way in the month of july 2023 you got a new career so a lot of career related changes happening in your life a lot of new beginnings maybe or maybe you may get shifted to a different department maybe you get a different project or you may decide to just kind of let go take some break as well if you are a homemaker a student or a retired person new career can also mean that in a day to day life you may incorporate certain changes that are going to kind of bring in a shift okay may not so for those uh, the read this card represents that let's see love yourself first so put yourself first no matter what it's important to take care of yourself and it's important to understand that if you do not make yourself a priority nobody else will let's see how self care how you nurture yourself use your hands so this card is telling you to create something of your own to spend your time in creativity rather than copy pasting somebody else's idea or work you have a lot of creative energy in you trust that energy and create something very powerful all right let's see other card learning how to be human in the world but not of it okay all right so here the card is telling you that get in touch with your core being okay which means that practice humanity at the same time practice self care self love as well all right it also means to to I mean this is more like a eight of cups energy over here all right so this card means that yes you need to be human 
okay and you need to have a human experience but you need to also get in touch with your inner higher self so that you are able to live this human experience without being bonded to it okay that's what this card means and which is more of a eight of cups energy now let's see the blessings coming your way in this month you have got the goddess of the moon so even though uh, you may feel oh my god what's happening how am i supposed to process this what should i do even though you may feel that you will be able to process your emotions in such a way that they bring in lot of concrete uh, productivity happiness joy so concrete results uh, you are going to get by processing your thoughts emotions fears as well okay so emotionally you will use and channelize your energy to bring things to fruition all right now let's see uh, what box you have got okay so this is your let's check this out green okay let's check your green box you're also going to see your other uh, tools as well so this is what you have got let's see it one by one so you have got a purple unique uh, you know uh, unicorn alicorn okay so clearly uh, you have been seeing a lot of unicorns alicorns around you and uh, this is telling you that you know believe in magic believe in your dreams do not think that your dreams are never going to come to fruition or will it will it ever manifest okay you got over here we are all in this together so your divine team is telling you that you're not alone in this okay so you you are having human experiences but you have this entire divine team supporting you rooting for you all right so you're not alone let's see so you again see this is a walking stick which means support you have the support of the divine i feel like angel raphael is with you the angel of healing you got over your uh, a, a a watch which means use your time properly manage time rather than spending your time just worrying 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 also utilize it to manifest so let me give an example over here so if something is worrying you think opposite of it so for example if you are worried oh my god my child has gone to the school what if something happens convert that thought visualize your child being happy and safe in school okay you got over here flowers so some of you may buy flowers you may give flowers to someone or you may receive flowers you may decorate your home with flowers as well or you or some floral aspect which will come in your life oh look at this you have got this baby charm all right so it can mean that there will be an addition in the family your family or your extended family or some of you may decide to uh take action regarding a baby or family it can also mean new beginnings okay cute isn't it all right you also dog got a dog and a dog represents loyalty so a lot, lot of loyalty coming your way if you have a pet dog you'll spend a lot of time with your dog uh, and if you're if you're uh, you, um if you are a pet daddy or a pet mama and your uh, pet baby is in heaven they're sending love to you all right let's your other charms you got over here see good in all things so this is what the five of pentacles energy opposite is so in five of pentacles you see everything that is not working out you feel insecure because of your past experiences the current scenarios and uh, this is urging you to see good in this because if you see the good in this there's a key lying out here this woman can just get up take the key and open the door all right so see good in all things that can definitely help the number 2 just kind of jumped which means have faith all right let's your other things you got over here outside so go outside at times we are always confined in our home 
and that further lowers our energy but when we go and have a walk outside in nature it really really helps just keep just ensure that you're safe oh look at that you got got outside park so if you have stopped jogging working out exercising time to do that again you got over here a pink tiny teddy bear so you may buy some toys for some children you may help children in some way as well teddy bear also means loving cushiony energy around you so that's going to happen as well now let's see the number that you have got you have got the number nine which means you're going to focus on your life purpose you also got the um, uh you did get the new career card so definitely something to do with your life purpose is going to change so the ones who are homemakers students your uh, retired people retired people you're going to take some steps with regards to your life purpose okay you have got the alphabets this could be your middle name uh, first name middle name last name initials or somebody else's first name middle name last name initials or maybe there's a word that requires your attention all right so uh, that can give you an idea so we have got over here okay We have got C O A A Y. We have also got I D E, and then we have got another D. So I can see the word code over here. So there is some code that is going to be unraveled in this particular month. Now let's see what your other cards are telling us. We'll see more of this to get a little more in-depth idea about july month okay. action all right so a lot of action you're going to take in this month especially at the end of the uh, month or the mid of the month you'll kind of start the process success and opportunities so you got a new career as well oh you got one more card wait 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 finding what is lost so do a uh, so eight of cups also talks of talks about on the quest to find what is lost okay so that's what's going to happen some of you may literally find something which you have lost let's see okay this kind of stuck okay, let's check you have got bag makeup perfume so some of you are going to buy this or you may get this as a gift let's see solitaire so solitaire you're going to shine like a diamond some of you may literally get a diamond as a gift or you may buy a jewelry or something as well now let's see what your wheel of fortune is going to tell us are you guys ready so think about a question group two and let me spin the wheel for you you have got a yes so whatever you asked for the answer is a yes group two so group two i hope you enjoyed this reading as much as i did if you did do hit the like button to subscribe to my channel if you are guided and also i am on instagram we are a family of 29,000 people i'm on facebook we're a family of 80,000 people do follow me there as well on insta i keep on sharing a lot of updates in stories i also share glimpses of my personal life as well in case if you want to see that and uh, my upcoming tarot workshop is going to be rolled out soon to know more details, click on the link given in the pinned comment. We have an early bird offer, which is for a very limited period of time. I hope you take benefit of it. All right. Take care. Bye-bye. Hello, group three. How are you guys doing? I hope you're fine and rocking as always. So let's see how the month of July 2023 is going to be for you. You've chosen this beautiful sage bundle, which means you're going to clear a lot of things. Clear your uh, cupboards, wardrobes, clear the area around you. I also feel that you're going to also uh, kind of stay away from people who are creating toxicity in your life. All right, so let me keep this bundle over here and let's see what the cards are going to tell us. 
Okay. I'm seeing a red ruby. Um, so I feel that uh, life purpose is going to be of importance. And for me, red ruby also, see this, this over here. Red ruby also means um, passion as well. So uh, something, you know, I feel that earlier you had kind of, you're feeling a little lost because things were not getting, not moving. However, now that passion will get recreated for life in general. Now, let's see the beginning. Oh, you got two cards. Okay, let's keep it over here. The beginning of the month. The, okay, the mid of the month. The end of the month. A departed loved one is sending love to you. Okay, now let's see your cards. The beginning of the month. Wow, you got eight of cups and nine of pentacles. Interestingly, all the three piles had eight of cups. So uh, you are also going to spend some time figuring things out, walking away from things which are not working, walking towards light as well, doing spiritual activities, uh, visiting spiritual places. And also I feel that you're going to spend a lot of time in solitude, figuring out your uh desires your life as well you're gonna nine of pentacles which means you're gonna buy some luxury items you're gonna spend time um uh, doing what you love you're gonna receive a lot of recognition abundance is going to come your way it looks like when you're gonna walk away from something or someone you will find abundance abundance of peace abundance of uh, prosperity, abundance of appreciation, recognition as well. Okay. Let's see the mid, mid of the month. Oh, the mid of the month, you have got seven of swords. So be very careful. Somebody may try to manipulate you, cheat you, do not fall for that. Also with this card, ensure that you are paying attention to uh, what is right and following the right path okay the end of the month you have got four of cups which means there is going to be an opportunity coming your way do not miss that opportunity all right with this card i also feel that uh, it's important that you count your blessings you may also feel very bored and tired and feel that you know i i don't know what i'm doing where is my life going as well so interestingly you have got seven eight nine number in your cards okay which means that initially you'll go ahead and then you'll kind of come back all right so to avoid this kind of energy you know going up and then coming down you need to focus on a lot of prayers rituals in the beginning of the month itself so that the entire month goes smooth the end of the month you should focus on gratitude all right now, when I look at this card, the story that I am getting over here is that you're going to walk away from something which will give you a lot of happiness and joy. However, you may start feeling that am I being selfish? Am I just looking at my own happiness and not everybody else? Okay, and that doubt will make you kind of feel a little lost. All right. So here, the cards are advising you that follow the right path, okay? So when you are walking away from something, once you are walked away from it, follow your soul's path. What is it that your soul is saying? Follow that and then focus on your blessings and what is positive in your life. This is what the story I'm getting from your cards. I teach tarot in detail in my upcoming tarot workshop. To know more about the details and to get the early bird offer, click on the link given in the pinned comment. All right. Now let's start with your, let's see your angel and oracle cards. Okay. Now let's see. You have got healing from the past. So again, eight of cups also talks about healing from the past that's the change coming your way healing from the past and finding your sunshine that's your next card you're getting to know each other 
सो स्पेशली इन द मिड ऑफ द वीक गेट टू नो पीपल बिफोर पुटिंग योर ट्रस्ट इन दैम और पुटिंग योर मनी ओके get to know others and then take action let's see you got energy work as i said in the beginning of the see this is what i love about the tarot and when things are in sync in the beginning of the month i did tell you that you need to focus on your energy ensure that you create a lot of positive energy by doing prayers rituals as well let's see you got doors are opening you decide rewards wild card so in the beginning of the month there will be doors opening however there is going to be a possibility with the seven of swords that there will be two doors opening one which will be a shortcut but not that ethical or not what you really want and the second door which will not be a shortcut it will be what you want but it will take a little longer time so follow the right path when this door is opening for you the blessing coming your way is walking away wow and you did get that with the 8 of cups as well and look at over here you know she's walking away towards something new and over here also she's walking towards something so amazing so definitely you're going to walk towards something which is going to bring you bring a lot of positivity in your life it's not going to be easy this transition but eventually you will feel you know what this is good for me now let's see your last box since you're the last pile you have got over here now or never so you know you even this said to you doors are opening you decide rewards rewards is shown with the nine of pentacles as well wild card so it will be like you do it now uh, don't do not pro procrastinate you got the penguin so penguin represents teamwork so ensure that you're doing a lot of teamwork you got the binoculars which means pay attention with the 7 of swords this is important pay attention do not turn a blind eye you got over here half moon it means that you either you're praying to the moon energy or you have some connect with lord shiva as well okay let me open this one you got good so the month is going to be good don't worry focus on the good you got over here do something creative every day so when you do something creative our brain gets an amazing workout you got over your ankle so ensure that you walk properly you got over here a beverage which means have some fun go to a cafe shop spend some time alone you got another beverage okay so stay hydrated and also do not let anybody spike your drinks okay you got camera over here so a lot of memories getting created okay wow look at this you have got take a chance and you got over oh, here now or never so but, however take a chance by properly evaluating what is right and what is wrong okay get proper information you got over here the number 16 which means manifest okay focus on manifestation and the number 6 represents um all your spiritual material needs are going to be met do not worry you got over your gemini sign oh and you got leo over here oh not gemini it is it is gener generous okay i'm so sorry it is generous and it's a leo sign let's see the alphabets they are they are got it could be a first name middle name last name initials or somebody uh, or a word that requires your attention you got over your m u mad okay don't let anybody slander your name okay you got s over here so if you go to the playlist i've shared lot of prayers and rituals that can kind of help you for different different things so have a look at it all right so you have got over here the alphabets r u a m u d o s g 
all right so i even get the word dua which means prayer that's lovely now let's see some let's get some more information from your other cards mm -hmm. take care of your throat Some of you may get cold and cough, uh, some fever, so take care of it. Go to a doctor. Okay, let's see. Love life. So your love life is going to shine for the better. You got good clothes. Some of you are going to buy some really great clothes. You got over here miracles. Wow. So expect good things. You got words. Pay attention to the words that you are using. Be grateful. Gratitude is the most highest energy that you can ever dwell into. Now let's see what your wheel of fortune is going to tell us. So think about a question. And let me spin the wheel for you. So you have got between miracle and no, all right? So this clearly means that whatever you asked for, it requires, it's going to be a little difficult, okay? In the sense that there's an exam that you need to give before you get what you're asking for. And this exam, the only way to passing this exam is to ensure that you follow the right path okay and if you're able to follow the right path and clear this exam there's a wild card there's a jackpot waiting for you now let's see what this card is saying why it's a miracle and a no in between is of wands because you need to create more energy as well so do prayers do rituals so that you do not miss this portal that's opening all right group three i hope you enjoyed this reading as much as i did if you did do hit the like button to subscribe to my channel also uh share this video with your friends and family i have an upcoming tarot workshop do not miss the early bird offer the link is in the comment section take care bye bye Hello my birthday babies, happy birthday to you, happy birthday to you, happy birthday my dear July babies, happy birthday to you, yay, your birthday has come, your birthday month, I'm so happy for you, it's such a blessing, right, okay, let's see how your birthday is going to be. I see some sparkling things. Okay, so you're going to get something which has got a little sparkling kind of a thing to it. Oh, you got the death rebirth card. All right. You have got the page of pentacles, knight of cups, and you have got the ace of wands. So yes, there are going to be some hiccups happening in your birthday. Uh, the things which you had planned may not go that way, which may kind of frustrate you, but do not worry. Uh, everything is going to be amazing. You may get certain books as gift as well. Or you may uh, spend time learning something. Okay. Uh, also at the same time you got Knight of Cups. Which means there will be uh, a really very sweet uh, gesture by someone happening for you. You have got the roses over here in the picture. You are going to get a lot of messages, uh, flowers as well in on your birthday. You got Ace of Wands, so something new is going to begin on your birthday. So there will be something which is ending and something new that is going to begin. However, it's not going to be that easy, this entire trans, uh, transformation. But do not worry. It will, uh, your wisdom is going to help you and the love that you have around you, that is going to help you. Overall, your birthday looks, uh, the gifts that I can see is something to do with fire, candles, uh light okay um and also what i see is books as well uh knowledge coming your way flowers chocolates messages wine for some people uh, so emotionally it will be like a little roller coaster kind of a ride now let's see what the other cards are telling us 
okay you have got adult children so if you have adult children uh, they are going to really make your day special and a little difficult as well if you are an adult child you may experience certain challenges from elder people around you okay you have got very soon so whatever you're asking for uh, it will happen very soon okay you got over your take a walk so on your birthday uh, you may just decide you know what I need just time to be with myself reviewing all that has happened before and you may spend time doing just that you got the love okay so over here what the card is telling you that it's time to not be dependent on somebody else to make your birthday special it's very important that we take the steps to make our birthday special this is something which i've learned over the years with regards to birthday stop having expectation that somebody else will make you birthday special by arranging a surprise party why not, why not arrange a party yourself invite people celebrate your birthday celebrate the your birthday with people you love if you have a particular wish with regards to what gifts you should receive and your spouse or your parents are lost and they don't know what to give you tell them what you what you expect make your birthday smoother for others okay let's the blessing coming your way adjust adjacent possibilities so what this card is telling you the blessing coming your way is a lot of doors are going to open for you on your birthday like you may decide that my birthday is going to go like a and you may be surprised that it goes b so it may so happen the blessing coming your way on your birthday is expect the unexpected but the unexpected is positive and unexpected as well as if there's something negative unexpected you'll be able to handle it so don't worry okay now let's see your charms you got umbrella over here so it's gonna rain okay so, or you may get an umbrella as a gift as well at the same time you're protected so do not worry you got over oh, your focus on being better than you yesterday so with every birthday we get a new opportunity to live a life that is closer to our purpose that brings an illumination as well so focus on being a better version of you never give up okay so no matter what even if your birthday may not start at a good note in case if it does not or something tends to like upset you do not get upset okay just replace it and do something positive okay you have got over here so there's this person ring uh, ringing the doorbell so a lot of people coming to your home a lot of deliveries happening at your home as well or you may go to someone's home or there could be a house party in my heart is a memory and there you will always be so somebody is not in your life anymore maybe they, it's a departed loved one or somebody who whom you're not in touch with they're telling you that they love you and your memory is with them you got over your dances so you're going to dance on your birthday you got show over your some of you may attend a show a stand-up comedy or a movie you got over your alert so be uh, very vigilant pay attention to your stuff as well so be vigilant okay that's important all right let's get some further cues on your birthday all right let's check this out travel some of you may travel on your birthday or make travel plans home yeah so i guess many of you are going to have a home party or you may visit someone's home as well now let's see what your wheel of fortune is going to tell us okay let's also open your yellow cards just to get more insight on your birthday all right white card as well Okay, let's check 
take a break so take a break from your day to day life and do something different or take some rest stuck paper work getting completed something just stuck is going to get completed that's amazing news birthday babies now let's see what your wheel of fortune is going to tell us so think about a question my birthday kiddos okay we all are kid okay <laughs> all right it's an inner child in all of us which loves birthdays okay so think about uh your question and let me spin the wheel for you you have got soon and interestingly you also got this card which spoke about very soon that's lovely that is so amazing my birthday kiddos all right enjoy your birthday if you like this video do like my channel do subscribe to it i have an upcoming tarot workshop uh which where wherein there's an early bird offer if you want to enroll for it click on the link below take care bye bye